Tuesday Central is a brand new once a week interactive show covering all 16 hockey teams, right from Victoria right to Prince George, doing feature stories, heading into buildings and looking at players, games and stats. And we got one right now with the brand new head coach of the Couch and Valley Capitals, Bob Beatty. I'm here with the brand new head coach of the Couch and Valley Capitals, Bob Beatty. Now Bob, the Capitals didn't have a great season last year. What were your first changes coming in? Well, we needed to, you know, evaluate uh, the organization and, uh, uh, you know, I think th there's a lot of, uh, you know, good uh, parts. Uh, we've got a great staff. Uh, you know, we needed to do a lot of recruiting, obviously, uh, upgrade our, our, you know, our skill set and our size. And, and uh, you know, we, we, there's some good uh, veteran leadership coming back but uh, we're going to have a you know a high percentage of uh, new players this year obviously. Uh, how did the training camp go so far? Uh, training camp's been great they've been working hard I know uh, you know two a days uh, you know it's taken a little bit of uh, toll on them the inner squad wasn't uh, quite uh, the pace that we expected it to be last night and you know I think we uh, you know, fatigue is setting in, uh, you know, to a degree, but uh, no excuses. We, uh, you know, we need to pay attention to detail. And, uh, you know, I, I thought, uh, you know, we went in spurts tonight. Uh, first exhibition game is over, uh, tied 3-3 with the Port Alberni Valley Bulldogs. What are your thoughts on that? Well, again, I thought, uh, you know, we had a pretty good start. I thought we had a pretty good first period and, uh, you know, a pretty good pace to it. Uh, we, Took the foot off the gas in the second. Uh, you know, uh, the Bulldogs. You know, they won more races and finished more checks in the second period. And uh, you know, we, the boys came back and uh, you know had a pretty good third period again. Uh, you know, late goal. You know, it's an exhibition game, but uh, you know, certainly an exciting finish. And lastly, Bob, what is your expectation for this season? Well, we're like everybody else. I mean, uh, you know, bottom line is we have to put a, a competitive, hardworking, entertaining team on the ice. And, uh, you know, uh, obviously we're, you know, we want to be in the playoffs and, uh, you know, do as well as we can. I mean, uh, we're not uh, taking a back seat to anybody. We have to, you know, have uh, a little bit of a culture change and uh, set the tone for, uh, uh, you know, for the years to come. Great, thanks, Bob. Thanks very much. Thank you, Bob. The Couch Valley Capitals home opener September 14th at the Island Saving Center versus the Port Alberni Valley Bulldogs. At this time, I got a chance to sit down with Evan Hammond, the play by play voice of the Port Alberni Bulldogs. All right, I'm joined with Evan Hammond, the voice of the Port Alberni Valley Bulldogs. Uh, what a season the Bulldogs had last year. What change did they make in the offseason? Uh, a whole bunch of them. Uh, it's, it's junior hockey, so I, I, I equate it to the Lion King. It's the circle of life, right? Yeah. You lose 10 guys, you get 10 guys uh, back. You try to recruit 10 to lose the, re, you know, uh, replace the 10 that you lost. Uh, lost a goalie, lost some, some high-end guys from last season. Uh, a couple stalwarts on defense uh, off the top of my head. Uh, lost Marlon Sable, lost Chase Van Allen. Uh, need to find a way to replace them. Uh, Teal Burns, Evan Tierney's, Ryan Law, J.D. Owenette, who was the MVP of the team uh, as any team that goes in a run like that, your goal is very important. Um, uh, I think the, the best returning uh, thing the team has is their coaching staff. Uh, it, it just seems that every year the Bulldogs have had a good season. They've lost their coaches, and uh, that's maybe harder to replace than anybody else. Is, uh, you know, th that culture and that familiarity uh, had a really uh, good season, 05 06, and uh, Jim Hiller went to the Western Hockey League. 2009-10 uh, had a banner year, and Nolan Graham then uh, left and went to the NCAA. So. Uh, nice to see Kevin Willison and Adam Hayduke back to, to try to build on what they, uh, they accomplished last season. Uh, talking about training camp, how's it going so far for the Bulldogs? Uh, so far, so good. I'm not the best guy to ask. I, uh, I'm uh, fully invested once the season starts and doing all 58 games. And uh, right now I'm kind of to the rank for half an hour at a time. And, and uh, you know, I'm, I'm kind of seeing the guys, but uh, I, I'm not really uh, elbows deep in it or anything. Um, uh, I, I like the way the, the, comp the compete level has been in camp. Uh, I like the way the, their inter-squad game looked, uh, their red versus white game, and so far so good in their first uh, exhibition game. But, uh, you know, 70% of the guys playing tonight will be playing somewhere else anyway. But it's still important to get, you know, that culture and uh, that mindset. Uh, you never want to lose, even if it's still in August, and I think you won't play it again until next August. 
And lastly, the expectation for this year, what do you think it is? Uh, I think it's uh, win the league championship, win the RBC Cup. Uh, I think it's, uh, on one end, it's it's dangerous if you uh, if you throw goals out like that that you can't accomplish. But I think if you, you know, you shoot for the, the stars, you end up on the moon, so to speak, right? And they, they won the Island Championship last year, lost an incredibly hard-fought four-game sweep series to the Surrey Eagles, a couple overtime games and, and one goal game. So uh, that's what the team goal would be, would be all in to, to win the league and get to the national championship in the Western Canada Cup. Great. Thanks, Evan. My pleasure. Thank you. Thank you, Evan. To catch all of Evan's play-by-play, -play, you can listen to him on 93.3 The Peak in Port Alberni. Thank you for watching this edition of BCHL Central. I'm your host, Tally Campbell. Follow us on Twitter at BCHL Central. Or for all your local sports needs, visit www.vsbn.ca. Thank <laughs> you.